Hey guys, here I am, my um, second tutorial on this channel. So, basically, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use um, the pen tool to create light streaks around your image. And as you can see here, I'm using a um, render, just it's already been cut out just to save time. And um, you can find this in my um, render pack if you're interested in using it. So, I'm going to be using the pen tool to um, create light streaks around um, the character. So as you can see I'm just um, curving the pen tool around this character's leg and I use this often in like text and different images and things I think it looks quite nice. I'll also be showing you guys how to uh, use the brush tool to improve an image and things like I used in my 3D vision speed art on my channel. Um, make sure you've got the brush selected and that ticked and also make sure it's on either 1 or 3 because more than that will probably be too thick um, at the moment I've got it on 3 and you're just going to want to right click stroke the path and make sure it's the same as that make sure it's on brush so now it's going to go over, under and over the leg as well so you're going to want to erase for example the middle section it will go over then under the middle section then over again I'm actually watching this uh, while recording the voiceover as well, just to let you guys know. So, sorry if I do fall behind, but the uh, original recording got a bit messed up. So, anyway, as you can see, I'm erasing um, the brush on the layer. Make sure you do the uh, brush stroke on a new layer, by the way, to the actual image in the layer above the image. So, you can go ahead and you can change the um, gradient. Just change it, play it around, play around with it, and just make sure you know it looks how you want it to look I mean, on this I think I had an outer glow and a green gradient and also I use the blur tool on the brush itself so I just think it looks nice to use the blur tool on the um, light streak so I think I just go ahead and um, create another one just on the arm just to show you guys again what to do just curve the um, pen tool into whatever shape you want it to look on a new layer, I forgot to create a new layer and uh, stroke path, make sure it's on this OK and right click and delete path I'm just copying and pasting the layer style to save me having to add the gradient and things again adding the blur tool and using the erase tool to make it look like it's um, going around the arm itself so in this tutorial I'll be showing you guys how to change these uh, lines into multicolored light streaks so they won't just be green, which I think I'll show you guys now. Okay, so I'm not sure what I'm doing at the minute. You, yeah, okay. So now to add uh, the light around it, you just want to create a new layer above the um, light streak itself. Um, select some different colors just to make it look nice. So you can change and just have different colors going around the leg. Um, it's nice to use like a thick brush just to make sure it covers the entire streak of the entire brush stroke alright so once you have the um, colors that you want uh, you want to create a new layer above the uh, light the brush stroke and uh, merge the brush stroke with the uh, blank layer and this allows you to um, go onto the colored uh, brushes that you've used there and um, create a clipping mask onto the light streak so as you can see you know it's blended in quite nicely I think I just used the um, brush tool no erase tool a little bit just to blend it in a little bit better because it's quite strong at the minute and that just yeah that just blends it in a lot nicer so I mean you can do this now with the um, other light streak but to save time I just leave the other one because I've already showed you guys and um, now you can go on to um, add uh, a ton of different colour styles onto your whole image by just um, adding the brush tool, uh, quite a thick brush tool, maybe like 200 and um, choosing whatever colours you want, like a bright colour usually looks quite nice. So I just go with a brightish colour, a cyan and a green colour just to cover the entire image. Okay, so make sure you do this on a new layer above like everything else and um, then just double click the layer and change the blend mode to overlay 
and as you can see it blends into the image you can see the image behind it actually now and uh, then I use the erase tool to blend it in because it's very strong at the minute so it looks a lot nicer blended in you can just see areas off the colour and then by actually selecting the render itself and using the erase tool on the um, render uh, you can make this look a lot nicer you see how the um, light uh, just it's hard to explain but it looks a lot nicer just to use the erase tool around the um, render itself and blend the colours they go they come out a lot stronger a lot lighter and uh, this is basically it it's just um, this is I use this a lot in my t my speed arts which I used in my 3D speed art and it just helps the final image look a lot nicer with these um, colours added to it and basically this is the tutorial so thank you guys for watching um, I'll be doing a lot more regular tutorials and hopefully a um, speed art tomorrow so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed the uh, video thanks for watching